Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have some really exciting news. Um, I, well, I guess as you can see by the title, it's not really a surprise anymore. But I'm getting a puppy. And I am set to get her next week, um, March 11th. Um, and I just wanted to do this haul because I've been buying a lot of stuff for her. I'm really excited. Um, it's going to be a Sheba, a new puppy, a female puppy, black and tan. And yeah, I just kind of wanted to share the news and do this video and show you guys what I bought so far. Um, okay, let's just get right into it. I have these little bins um, over here that I'm going to go through. And her section is over there. Her bins go over there. But I just put them over here for the video. So let's start with the first one. I got her a blanket. A pet blanket. It's 50 inches by 60 inches. So it's actually pretty big. I got this one from Ross for like $8. And it has little pop-ups on it. This is, um, yeah, that's the only thing in this bin. But... I bought it kind of, sort of, to match her bed. I got her a little princess bed. It's a crown. It's not teeth. <laughs> I found this bed at Marshall's. Um, and it was $20. And I know she's only going to have it for when she's small. And that's fine. But it was so cute. I just had to get it. The first time I saw it, I didn't get it. And then I was like thinking about it. And I was like, oh, I should have got it. So I went back and I got it. So she's going to have that for a few months or so. And then I'll get her a bigger one. Now let's move on to the toys. Oh, and by the way, this bed here is expensive, okay? Because when I was looking for it on Amazon and stuff and online, it was like $60. And I got it for $20. And they also have it at TJ Maxx. I saw it today. And I bought her this today also from TJ Maxx. I don't really shop at TJ Maxx, but... Or was it Home Goods? I don't know. Same difference. I think they're owned by the same people. That's why they always think to each other. Um, yeah, I got this. I am very adamant about no squeaky toys. I personally, I just don't want to listen to it. So, most of our toys are non-squeaky. That's the sole reason I got this. Like, I, I didn't think it was cute or anything. I was just like, this is the one toy in here that doesn't squeak. Or the one of the two toys. This was the other one. Squishy toy that does not squeak. I thought it was cute. I used to play soccer. She's gonna be like her mommy. And I also got this today. Just to I guess play tug of war. I have a little brother, so if they wanna come and play with her. Um, we can all kind of play with this a little bit. Um, her color scheme that I'm using for most of her stuff is blue and purple. Like this light blue and purple. So most of this stuff is going to be the same color. The next thing is this. Again, blue and purple. Now this does squeak. It was an accident though. I didn't mean to get something that squeaked. I didn't know. But I think they can come out. I think these little squeaky things can come out. So I'm gonna do that. I'm very adamant about no squeaky toys. I'm sorry. Oh wow, and I got her this, another blue and purple. I saw this today and I was like, I should get her this. I, I didn't realize I'd already got it. I was like, I should get her this, but I was like, no, because I already got all this other stuff. She has enough of things like this. Um, so yeah, I'm glad I didn't get it. And there's this. I get these from Dollar Tree. Okay, you got to go to one of the good Dollar Trees and get one of these. They last, they last a good little minute because um, we have another dog upstairs, um, Apollo. He's a pit and his teeth are a lot sharper because he likes to chew on bones and stuff. And he plays with these and he rips in the shreds, but they last a long time. If you, you probably can hear him barking. He's barking because I'm talking right now and um, I'm downstairs. So I don't, I don't know. I think he's confused. Anyway, we have this little thing again. I'm very adamant about no squeaking, no squeaking. Mommy's gonna be working. 
working on the computer. Don't have time for you squeaking on my Zoom meetings. And I got this. I got this from Dollar Tree also, I think. And this from Dollar Tree. And I have, um, I bought some other ones for Apollo upstairs, but I'm gonna chew them up. Well, I think one of them is still together. He chewed up the one like this, and it's hanging on for a little while longer. And I got him something like this, and it's still alive. So she's a puppy, so these should last a good amount of time. Let me just toss this stuff back in here. She's gonna be good on toys. I kind of went a little overboard. Okay, now time for the important stuff. Well, this is all important, but you know. So, the dog wash and stuff. So I figured I'd try this. I bought a different one, and it was lavender, and I got it from Marshalls, I think. And it was very similar to this, but I laid it sideways in one of these bins, and I didn't realize it was leaking. So I'm keeping this one right side up. And I'm gonna see how it how it does. Um, you know, I'm a little weary, but it has a lot of natural ingredients in here, so I like that. I just bought this today from I think it was Home Goods. I'm gonna need this for both dogs. And I bought this because um I feel like pets should wipe their feet off when they come inside from outside. You know? Because they're gonna wanna jump on the couch and on the bed and stuff and on you. Oh man. Okay. And I got these nail clippers. I thought it was just a good to have them. I don't plan on cutting her nails. It makes me nervous. But, you know, just in case. I think that's everything from this bin. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now for the other really important stuff. I just got these little puppy cats from Dollar Tree. I'm going to get like a hundred packs from Amazon. Yeah, but I thought you know, it was four in here and it was a dollar, so why not just grab them just in case, like travel convenience or something. I also got these from, these from Dollar Tree. Yep. Um, they're, I thought they were cute. Most of this stuff is blue in here. This color scheme is blue. Huh. Okay. This was Apollo's when he was tiny. This was his when he was tiny, he was so little. We have even, we have a smaller one, an even smaller one than this. But I think she should be able to fit this. And, because I don't really know how big she's gonna be when she gets here, she's gonna be nine weeks. And I also got this little cute little doggy harness. She's so cute. It's a mesh, it's real cute. And I got this leash, I think. I forgot how long it is. I got this leash. Nice, that's a little squishy part. Um, what else? Yeah, this brush from Dollar Tree. I am going to get the vacuum. That's why um, I didn't mind getting a little cheap one like this because I'm going to get the vacuum, um, which is going to be what I use to really get all of her out. And this is, I guess, just for, you know, you should always have a backup. And then I bought this. Okay, if you don't know, I'm a huge Marvel fan. Like, I'm way too hyped for Falcon and Winter Soldier. We just watched the season, the series. What's the series? No. Well, I don't know. They okay. Anyway, the season finale of WandaVision. It was great. Um, and I'm so glad she evolved because Wanda, um, Scarlet Witch is like one of my favorite characters from the from the comic book and the cartoons. The cartoons mainly. Um, but she was just so like downplayed and weak in the Avengers and I was like, I'm not feeling this. Like, sis is the strongest Avenger, the strongest everything in Marvel. Maybe not stronger than Jean Grey. Like, she's on that level of power. Anyway, I'm off on a tangent. I just, I love Marvel. But anyway, so I found this and this is Black Widow. So I thought this was so cute. Is it still blurry? Anyway, it's a Black Widow one. I thought it was really, really cute. Um, 
for her, even though it's not blue. I wanted to get her a Captain America one, but then I was like, people are definitely going to think she's a boy if I do that. This Captain America is also my favorite. He's my number one. I love him. I love him. Anyway, um, where I fell out of that bin. I got this today at somewhere. TJ Maxx or Home Goods, one of them, I don't know. And it's like a little dog food holder. Now, the breeder that I'm getting her from uses um, Great Lakes food. But I'm going to try something different. I've heard really good things about Canada. Lots of great reviews. So I'm going to try this food. Um, mix it in with some wet food a little bit. So yeah, that's fine. And I got this from Pet Flora. Let me hurry up and finish so he doesn't start working. Okay. <laughs> Now, I went to Target because I was watching this video. This other girl had a sheep and a puppy. It was like six years old, but still, she was like talking about all these different dog foods at Target and these good deals on them. So I was like, I'll go check it out. The deals were no longer there. It was six years ago. But I did find the ones she was talking about. They were still relatively cheap, so I got a lot. So I got this bagging. The bacon with the cheese flavor, and I got this bacon. I think it's just bacon, just bacon. Yeah. And I put in the little bin, keep it airtight. The top training pieces. I do like training puppies on basic commands. Um, and these little things. We got some beef here, and I got chicken here, and then bacon flavor. And I got this little thing and it's open because I bought it so that Apollo could have one he ate it already he literally ate the whole thing already and it looks like this and I got it for her so he can have one and she can have one okay so yeah this is what it looks like you see it's really cute he has a little door here it rolls up and then the velcro pieces this um, zips closed it's just really nice to be, you know, to be on the go and go somewhere. Um, we have a crate that Apollo used to use. That also, that actually came from a former dog we had named Kai. Where we rehomed him, we gave him to a really nice family. Um, yeah. Uh, that's about it. I think it has a lot of space. I keep her little, I, keep, I have put that in there. And I want to put some toys in there for her. And pee pads down on the bottom of it. But yeah, that is that. I almost forgot. Um, this is the bowl I ordered today. It's a slow down bowl. Um, and it's a yin yang. They say it's blue, but it looks kind of mint. So we'll see, you know. But yeah i ordered this it was only like 15 dollars and it should be here i think on monday okay actually i forgot because remember when i said that i spilled the stuff the shampoo all over it i spilled it all over this thing and so this box was like super wet so i just went ahead and took it out took the car thing out and put it in my car so i'm going to show it to you guys okay so this is the real last thing okay this is the car mat thing that goes in here so she doesn't pee all over my seats um yeah this is the real last thing that i got for my puppy and it's really big and i got it from marshall's a while ago so yeah okay guys so that is the end of my video that is my haul for all the stuff i bought for my new puppy and yeah i'm gonna just end it there and be sure to stay tuned for more videos don't forget to like comment and subscribe and especially be on the lookout for my first 24 hours with my puppy video um other than that thanks for watching and bye